take down sixth problem. The same exercise 3.4, right? Same exercise on 3.4. Take down sixth problem. What is given to you? If alpha and beta are the roots of the equation x square plus x plus 4 is equal to zero, prove that alpha power n minus beta power n is equal to i into 2 power n plus 1 sin n pi by 3. This is what we are going to do. Also detect, detect up to find the value of alpha power 9 minus beta power On a summary, first one, we are going to solve this quadratic equation. We are going to find out what is alpha and beta. So, are you telling x power minus 2x plus x power minus 2x and now we are going to put it down like this square minus 2ab plus b square. So, in the plus 4 one day, number every break from a board of dinner, you write plus 1 plus 3. Number yelling at first moon term of group on a real number. This can be as minus 1 the whole square is equal to minus 3. Taking square root on both sides, x minus 1 is equal to root or minus root of minus 3. So, x minus 1 is equal to plus or minus root of Square. x minus 1 is equal to plus or minus 2 3 i put this minus 1 on the right hand side you will get x is equal to 1 plus or minus i root 3 so roots of the equation are the 1 plus or minus i root 3 really yeah so let alpha is 1 plus i root 3 beta is 1 minus i root 3 what we are supposed to prove now? To prove that alpha power 9 minus beta power n, sorry, alpha power n minus beta power n is equal to i into 2 power n plus 1 into sin n pi by 3. This is the proof we want. And also detect alpha power 9 minus beta power 9. That is what we need to do. So, here first is the proof. Alpha and beta value 1 plus i root 3. That is to prove that 1 plus i root 3 whole power n minus 1 minus i root 3 whole power n is equal to i into 2 power n plus 1 sin n pi by 3. This is proof. How do you prove it? We have the fourth sum of the subdivision. We have the fourth sum of the subdivision. They are the output of the first one. You write this complex number 1 plus i root 3 is the number of form. Right. 1 plus i root 3 is equal to what is polar form? R into cos theta plus e sin theta. Call this as star. Except means 1 plus i root 3 is equal to multiply term by term. R into cos theta plus e times R into sin theta, we call this as double star. So, next step one we want r and theta. So, you find out first what is r, r is equal to root of x square plus y square. What is the value of x? x is 1, y is root 3, root square pannang 1, root 3 square pannang 3, I have to write it that is root of 4 is 2. So, the value of r is 2. Next one we have to find out theta by equating real part and imaginary part in double star. We get equate the real part this is the imaginary part 1 is equal to r cos theta and this cos theta is what? cos theta is 1 by r. And what is r? 1 by r by the 2 which is positive. They may equate the imaginary part left hand side root 3, right hand side r sin theta are clear. From this sin theta is equal to root 3 by r. This is root 3 by 2 that is also both cos theta and sin theta are positive, therefore theta lies in first quadrant. So, theta is equal to, you must tell me what is the value of theta. Can you tell me? Cos of n the angle.
angle 1 by 2 varum sin of end angle root 3 by 2 varum proof la irukku paarenga 5 by 3 so theta is 5 by 3 proof vachu kandupidichiralam next step is you substitute the values of r and theta in star star implies 1 plus i root 3 is equal to 2 into cos of i by 3 plus i sin i by 3 3 da next step is 1 plus i root 3 rising to the power n 1 plus i root 3 whole power n is equal to 2 power n into cos i by 3 plus i sin pi by 3 the whole power n ஏ நம்ம பவர் என் ரைஸ் பண்றோம்னா बिकॉज ப்ரூஃப்ல அந்த மாதிரி இருக்கு we must prove that 1 plus i root 3 whole power n minus 1 minus i root 3 whole power n is equal to this much we have to prove right அதனால தான் நம்ம வந்து ரைஸிங் டு தி பவர் என் பண்றோம் அடுத்த ஸ்டெப் வந்து 2 power n bring the power inside that means we have to apply sigma wise theorem cmt cos n pi by 3 plus i sin n pi by 3 all this is equation number 1 this is the value of 1 plus i root 3 whole power n similarly 1 minus i root 3 whole power n is 2 power n cos n pi by 3 just replace i as minus i right replace i by minus i the plus i is pathingla and edathula namma minus i nu maatha porom So, what is the symbol? We have the symbol of minus i sin minus i sin n pi by 3. All this is equation number 2. Now, what is in the problem? Add and subtract. What is the symbol of the symbol? Subtract. So, we have to subtract. Take down subtract 1 and 2. Subtract 1 and 2. Subtract 1 and 2. Take down. equation 1 minus equation 2 implies 1 plus i root 3 whole power n minus 1 minus i root 3 whole power n is equal to 2 power n subtract panna bodhu can you tell me what is the common factor 2 power n ye veli eduthirenga 2 power n into subtract panna bodhu inge vandu minus varum inda edathula plus varum so in the rendu terms und will get cancel epovume cos term cancel aidum subtract panna bodu sin terms alone will survive sin term da ange irukum so i sin n pi by 3 inga paarenga i sin n pi by 3 inge oru plus irukku paathinga la sin n pi by 3 this can be written as i into 2 power n plus 1 sin n pi by 3 call this as sum a 99 percent mudiju pochu appra ena kekkaranga also deduct alpha power 9 minus beta power 9 thana so you put n is equal to 9 in equation a equation a la inga la n irukum inga la 9 apply pannunga so what you will get equation a implies 1 plus i root 3 whole power 9 minus 1 minus i root 3 whole power 9 it is equal to i into 2 power 10 ebi 10 vandu theriyuda edathil 9 apply pandrom so that you will get 9 plus 1 will become 10 into sin 9 pi by 3 i into 2 power 10 into sin of cancel panna enna varum you will get 3 pi So you know what is the value of sin pi, sin 2 pi, sin 3 pi? All of them are zero, da. So the value is going to be zero. Since sin of 3 pi is equal to zero. So final value, when you look at that, zero is there. So this is the this problem is also very very important. Ten mark. So when you March 2012, look at that. Ten mark. Note when you check that. This problem has been asked in March 2012 in 10 marks. Very very important. Next problems only we will continue in the next class. Right? Thank you.